Yeah, it looks like weather's going to be fantastic for the rest of this week. Just a little chilly, perhaps, for some of you. Now that you've gotten used to all these 80 degree temperatures we've been seeing lately, it's going to be a little cool tonight. But we're expecting a big warm up by the end of the week. We're going to be back to around 90, looks like, by Friday afternoon, believe it or not. So, the last couple of days this week, actually looking really nice. Before we welcome Serene, we actually need some of that too. We're going to be getting that. Looks like here for the middle part of the weekend. Temperatures in the metro right now. Uh, the Inner Harbor at 71 degrees, really south of the Beltway. We're looking at those less, low 70s through northern Anne Arundel County, including the airport, Glen Burnie, Severn, and uh, also down into portions of Howard County. We're seeing upper 60s, mid to upper 60s, though, we get north of the Beltway, as you can see there through Glen Arm and uh, out towards Cockeysville, Reisterstown, Owings Mills. And the coolest temperatures in the state, though, of course, out in the mountains, far western Maryland at 52 there in McHenry. And Oakland looking at temperatures, though, in the low 70s, even some mid 70s over on the eastern shore. Easton at 75 right now. Pretty nice afternoon shaping up across the state. The winds really have been the big issue today, gusting out of the west over 30 miles an hour at times, and that's what elevated the fire danger through the afternoon. Winds are going to come down some tonight, and the temperatures will be coming down too. 60s, 50s, and eventually into the 40s overnight tonight. When you wake up tomorrow morning, we'll be in the low 40s, but we're going to warm up very quickly as the air is still very dry, and whenever the air is dry and the humidity is low, the temperatures warm up quickly, and they also cool down quickly. So. We're going to be in the 70s before you know it here by tomorrow afternoon. You can see the cloud cover associated with this upper level area of low pressure that's been hanging out over the Great Lakes is finally moving out of the way. And as it lessens its influence on our area, the winds will start coming down. We're expecting that to occur here later tonight and tomorrow. And the rest of the week looks fantastic weather wise. Lots of sunshine expected here for tomorrow, Thursday, Friday, and temperatures going up with each passing day. Mid 70s tomorrow. Then getting into the mid to upper 70s, mid to upper 80s, I should say, on Thursday, and then upper 80s to around 90 coming up on Friday afternoon. Notice here on Saturday, clouds will be increasing. There's our next chance for rain. This should be coming in, looks like, uh, Saturday night and into the first part of Sunday. All right, so for Cecil County tomorrow, this is what you can expect. Temperatures upper 60s to around 70 here for uh, Port Deposit and Rising Sun, Chestertown uh, getting up to around 69 degrees and also up towards, uh, looks like, Areas of uh, Carroll County getting in the low to mid 70s here for tomorrow. So, pretty nice day shaping up across the region. Here's a look at your first alert 7 8 forecast. 86 here coming up on Thursday. 89, that would be a record if we hit that on Friday. Of course, with O's back in town here for a nice home stand here heading into next week. Weather looks good. Chance for rain though coming in later Saturday into the first part of Sunday.